So I'm all dressed up like this because I'm on the Patia off-road safari. And although there's a little bit on road, most of it is miles from anywhere. Look at the view behind. We've got Sata Heap. And we've just come through all the fields, over the rocks, between the trees, and we've hardly hit anything at all. If you want to have a different type of adventure in Patia, this is the place to come because it's a totally different experience. The only thing is, which way is back? So the good news is all of these tours are fully guided and the guides speak some English and plenty of Thai, so you can be understood. They don't seem to worry whether you've got a driving license or not. Full tuition is given before you start off and all of the safety equipment is provided. It's a bumpy ride, so wear sensible clothes. And coming up soon, you might understand why they give you that rainproof top. I'll be buying a new camera bag. Hopefully, I won't be buying a new camera just yet. You're going off down the lanes, down the country tracks. Most of it is off road. It's just like a Sunday morning drive down to the supermarket back home. Grandma's welcome. But actually, you get some spectacular views because you're going through farmland across the fields into the woodland and it's a good time to come that it's just been raining here and it's not too hot. So here we are on the off-road safari and we're in the smaller of the two buggies but this one's a new one that she's given to me. Oh we're going to turn right apparently. Or well, maybe it's just time for a selfie. Yeah? Yeah. It's good? Yes, it's good. Okay. Is that okay? Yeah, no problem. It's only it's a big little bit, huh? Eh? Ah, my belly cat, my belly. So we're off into the hills. Into the hills and far away. There's so many dirt tracks around here. It's perfect for taking the buggies. The steering is really easy, although you will be giving your arms a bit of a workout by the end of two hours. And they do do two or three different types of buggy. This is the two-seater buggy. And if you want a second driver, you just pay extra. But they do also do a four-seater family buggy. Uh, that's an extra thousand baht. Or they do some monster buggies that are even more powerful that you can have for a half-day tour or a full-day tour. I booked for the two-hour trip. And to be honest, after spending two hours in the driving seat, that's probably long enough for a beginner. If you don't want the buggies, they also have the ATVs here. And if you're a bit of a biker, they have enduro bikes as well. So some of the off-road safari is actually on road, but most of it is completely uncharted territory. And we just had a run through the fields and it was raining last night so we got wet a few times as well which is all part of the fun and he says we're off to the mountains now turning left is that the way to the mountains only one way to find out i think you do about 30 kilometers during the course of the two hour enduro it certainly seems to be enough to wet your appetite They give you the helmet, they give you the goggles, good job too because I wear contact lenses and even on a rainy day there was plenty of dust going around so I was grateful for those. The only small problem we had with the car was that the door kept on opening, the catch wasn't strong enough. So I'm going behind trying to attract the lead driver's attention by opening and closing the door and driving only with one hand. That's not dangerous, is it? No. But no worries with one of these buggies. You just take off the door and just get on with it. I mean, 
What could be simpler than that? We didn't need a door anyway. Yeah, we don't need it now. That's good, though. Uh, uh, I got it. Tuck, 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 tuck. Take off. Uh -huh. Yeah, I take off, eh? Yeah, yeah, okay. we don't need it. Come on. Let's, let's. Let's see. This day for me. Yeah. Don't worry, don't worry. It's okay. No problem. I should say, where are we? Well, we're over at Mapratan Lake, and the address really is Siam Country Club Road, but you might know that it's near to Route or Route 66 restaurant, so it's quite easy to find, and I got over by taking a bolt this morning, and that was about 150 baht one way. They do these tours three times a day, 9.30, 12.30, and 3.30, and as was the case when I went, even if there's only one car going out, they still go out seven days a week. Come rain or shine. So two hours at the off-road safari, that is 4,500 baht. If two people want to drive, they charge you an extra 500 baht, making 5,000 baht. That sounds like a lot of money, but I can tell you, I feel that that's money well spent because I've had a whale of a time Come after it's rained, it's raining a little bit now, and you'll enjoy it even more. Plus, you've got the Route 66 Diner as well, where I had my breakfast. It's a really good half day out, and it's not far from Patia. Come on down. Mm -hmm.